Hi there, Collective. This is your reading in between the readings. So if you are drawn to this reading, like the pictures, the cards, the title, whatever that ends up being, then it's probably for you and some Palo Santo. <laughs> I was, I'm getting a feeling drawn to doing a Celtic cross actually for this reading. Three of Cups, nice, Death card, Transition, All right. I'm gonna use Osho Zantero. Always feel drawn to this deck. <clears throat> All right, messages. For the collective that are getting a message from this specific reading, opening up to your spirit team, your angels, your spirit guides, my mom who's definitely an angel, Helping with this situation. Oh, it's about investing in yourself. Okay. 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 Investing in yourself. What is the challenge? Getting out of a commitment. <laughs> Breaking a commitment. And, oh, man. In the heart of the matter, the lovers. The lovers card. At the heart of the matter. Hmm. What's past? Queen of Wands, past, almost in reverse. It's kind of like I'm almost brave enough to do something, almost confident enough. What's the uh, goal or destiny here? To not be tricked, to not be decept, to not be deceived, to. Be transparent, no fooling around, having a good strategy, coming up with a good strategy. It's future energy looking like. Well, that's beautiful. This is like advice. <laughs> the um, magician in the reverse, but I have the, um, the fool as your future energy that's really really good there just needs to be some more confidence in your own magic and some investing in yourself there's motivation oh it's motivation so there's something that's affecting motivation and um making it i don't know why but like wanting a new fresh start wanting to take a leap of faith but waiting for something to motivate you um i understand that what's uh how are you feeling in transition resistance resistance to um a chapter ending and having this new beginning there's a resistance even though goals and destiny has you being pretty transparent about what you want there's still more strategy or more thought that needs to be put into strat strategizing or coming up with like a plan a strategy what about in the uh environment in the environment whoa and the bird wants to be freed <laughs> the bird wants to be freed page of cups um and Osho Zentero is really a beautiful example of a bird that's getting ready to, you know, go fly with the other birds. Be free. It's usually representing the start, the beginning, something kind of um, new. Might be regarding uh, art or makeover or it is, an, it is regarding investing in yourself. With that Ace of Pentacles being in the reverse, it's about investing in you. Tell me about the um, hopes or fears. <clears throat> hmm. Emotional manipulation. Don't want somebody to do this to you. 
I don't want somebody, I don't want to take the risk of some kind of commitment. Like the heart is feeling something. This even might be a new person. It's a crossroads for sure. But, but the fear of manipulation is here. The fear of somebody not being genuine with you. Or where, yeah. What's the outcome? And we saw that. Saw that on the shuffle. Oh, wow. Here's your confirmation. Ace of Swords. That's a very, uh, that's a good card for confirmation. To say yes, yes, yes. Wow. And then the Six of Cups with the Ace of Wands is new. Adventure. A soul tie. A connection. Soul family. Soul mate. Uh, it's about the journey. It's about, uh, about, to me, this reading says it's about what's next. Um, and this card, pr pretty much this card and how you're feeling really represent the needing some kind of motivation. Hmm. Kipper, give us some, um, this could, I mean, you know, with the heart of the matter, that could be also a soulmate connection breaking of a commitment, the nothingness turned reverse as a challenge. Turning nothing into something. All right, what, let's start with the past here. What is this deal with the um, Queen of Wands? Why is it somewhat more submissive than a normal Queen of Wands would be? Privileged lady. Feeling like something maybe, or maybe feeling like stuff or things were coming easier here to you in the past. Having a lot of access to uh, energies that made things easy, made it so that you didn't have to do as much for yourself. Like, <laughs> so maybe it's not about being submissive, but that somebody always did something for you work something out for you and so now it's like you need to invest in you it seems like there's a lot that were, was invested in you from others here in the past and now the issue is investing in yourself message of concern is popping out okay is it with how you can invest in yourself What about, um, what about this challenge? Mature woman. This can be like growing up. That can be like growing up. And, and here it's almost like saying that there was a time and a place for others to put a lot of investment in you and now... This is about maturing and you investing in yourself and growing from you giving to yourself as the privileged lady, like you giving yourself that privilege. Hmm. What's the lovers about at the heart of the matter? What's this crossroads about? <laughs> the marriage card. For so, so, and then they have this is the death card in reverse as to how you're feeling. But so, there is a crossroads that involves to me, this is involving really putting a situation to end, a, a commitment to end, and then taking a leap of faith in something. There's an actual soul tie or connection or bond here. You even have confirmation with the aces, both of them. Many paths and many possibilities. I have a feeling like this is, that this is something older that had already ended, but in your feelings, may have not completely. And maybe the what the cause is for the 
unmotivation or you know what I mean? <clears throat> What about the goal and destiny with the seven of, okay. <laughs> Sadness. Oh, it's a despair. Give me something else. Don't just leave me with that main mail. And that despair card is like looking for work. Or it's embarrassment. It could be that somebody was caught. And um, it, th this could have been like what, um, uh, you know, like when you pre predoom a situation. So what's the new thing in the environment? The page cups uh, upgrade. What's the new thing? House. Else. Gift. Jeez. No. Too many, but we'll take this deck to next. Why is the house coming out? Because sometimes the house, if it's not representing an actual house, it can represent what you're building. Um, and solid foundations and things like that. The rich gentleman gift. The wealthy man, the wealthy the gift. Okay, explain more about the gift and this um, new beginning. Leaping into faith, <laughs> leaping into faith, court, making something official. Oh, and it might be something about the paperwork or doing things like by the book that's kind of, I don't know, it might be about something that's tedious <laughs> to do. Sure, man. Explain more about court. Uh, and of course, for some, it really might be that a property is, is earned or won through some kind of um, court ruling. The moon. Oh, I love the moon and the Lenormand because that's like all about fame. Being um, honored. Fame. Fame, honor, recognition. It focuses a big spotlight on you. <clears throat> it is a sign of great honor, though. There may be how, okay, so it may be associated with the hard work and determination, too. So that might be the thing that is like some, something might just be tedious. That's why, you know, the, uh, the red tape, the paperwork. But you really have so many energy here. I don't know if you've known this person. To, if to me, that card comes across more as like, just the feeling of the energy of feeling very comfortable imagining daydreaming possibly even tell me more about six of cups ace of wands holds the key to this new is something that about it that holds the key 33 <clears throat> <laughs> Again, being recognized is coming out with the high honors card, occupation. And then I have the glad, what? Something you're not seeing, clearly. Because of the clouds. I don't see this as a bad thing. Something you're not seeing very clearly. about why you should be motivated is it about motivation hang on is this clouds about um motivation what is this clouds whoa dang 
that came out really stark. Okay, so that's kind of like your king of swords. <clears throat> it it's there's something that's needing to be cleared up for you or lawyer energy or somebody that is an expert that can help clear up some mystery with this clouds energy. So how do we get to feeling motivated? So I would definitely say somebody that from the outside, <clears throat> somebody that can clear up things. <coughs> Excuse me. Tell me about um, how we're feeling, how we can, how we can help that. Oh, false person. Oh, the false person card flipping out on top of the message of concern and the Queen of Wands is somebody that is, uh, well, the Queen of Wands, especially like that, could be somebody that's got a persona or a mask, right? So there's something that maybe could be affecting your occupation or the key to what you do, the key, and it has involves taking off a mask, being authentically you, Stepping away from imposter syndrome. Um, not wanting to... Being resistant to a transformation that has you taking off the mask. That has you being very transparent. And there are people here to help. Also, access to wealth, wealth resources. Like I said, there's plenty of gifts here it's like being a, a bigger fish in a small pond and feeling like oh i've got to go to a bigger pond it's kind of like that theft privileged theft imposter if, if you ever if that that card relates to you as far as um doing or acting like something that you are not a false person a false falsely identifying as a certain way and this is your trip this is your journey this is this investment will lead to your maturity gaining and funds too and um this feeling of not feeling that great is just temporary with the brief illness it's an unhealthy situation that gets cleared up And I'll tell you why it gets cleared up. Here's the clover. <clears throat> Here is your clover. Luck, good fortune. It's an upturn to how you're feeling. You'll have an upturn to how you are feeling. That's what I'm saying. Ah, so that's what I've got for you guys. That is just your... A collective read if you need a private reading i do offer those that is in the description box below that's the wise person hat you'll be playing a different role butterfly change for the better Al, good advice from a wise person and look the star the guaranteed success so you can't lose uh, but it is about trying and, and wanting to free yourself somehow all right that's what i've got sending you love and light like and subscribe come back please do bye